welcome to our second episode of Science and Peaches. Today we are going to be learning how to make slime and learning about slime. And slime is actually like like part of a solid and a liquid. And this experiment came from one of my favorite books, Science Rocks. So yeah. For this experiment, the question is what makes the best slime? The purpose is to explore different polymers, which are kind of like a type of plastic. My hypothesis is that adding different liquids to cornstarch will result in slimes of different consistencies. The independent variable is the thing you change in an experiment. For this experiment, I will change the type of liquid added to the cornstarch. The dependent variable is what happens after using the independent variable. It's, it is like the results. For this experiment, the consistency of the slime is the dependent variable. The constants are the things that don't change in an experiment. Okay, so first, I have this whole bowl of cornstarch, and I'm just going to pour it all into the bowl. Next, we're just going to pour a little bit of water and then stop. And then you're going to take your spoon and then mix it up. So it, it's starting to feel like really hard. It's not really feeling that mushy. Okay, so it's a few days later. We made like a new batch of slime. We, and now it's like better. And we added yellow food coloring this time. So it looks more like slime. So it's like, a, it looks like nice and liquid in like a swimming pool, but really when you go like that hardly, then it's actually like a solid. Okay, so I have the same amount of vinegar in this and the same amount of vinegar, I mean glycerin in this. So we're going to... So there's three spoons of them in each cup, and we're gonna see what happens to them when we just and when we don't use any water. So first, I'm going to do the vinegar. Feels like it's getting really strong now. Now it's really strong and it's not gooey. You can just let go of it and it falls like that. Good. Now I'm going to do the glycerin, pour it in, and then let's see if it makes it more flexible. Like it's getting really flexible. Yep, it feels really flexible now. It feels like yogurt too. Okay, so I'm gonna recap. So a polymer is like a ch it's like the chain of the molecule. So vinegar makes a more stronger polymer, and like the the glycerin one, it makes like more flex like a more flexible polymer.